De La Rosa Car Parks 1 and 2 are currently managed and owned by LL Property Management Corporation. De La Rosa Car Park 1 and 2 are located in De La Rosa Street, Legaspi Village, Makati. The car park is open from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. every Monday to Friday and 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. every Saturday. The car park is closed on Sundays and on holidays. The peak days are during Mondays to Friday. The number of slots in the car park is around 402 on the hourly and 959 on the reserved. The car park is surrounded by several office buildings, condominiums, and malls. It is located at the Central Business District or also known as the Concentration of Retail and Office Buildings in Makati, ELDT MGO, National Life Insurance, Philippine First Bank, Starcom, BDI, and condominiums like SGV 1 and 2, the Asian Mansion, Shangdan Tower, and other buildings are also located around the car park. Currently, 31 buildings around the Larosa car park. Multiplying this number to the number of floors per respective building with a standard of 9.5 square meter per employee, you can compete the potential market of around 19,690. Removing the 17% of this for executives will get around 16,342. Reducing this number to 95% to remove those who prefer to eat somewhere else will get around 15,500 people. Multiplying this percentage to the capacity of direct competitors, which is around 21%, we will get 3,200 people. Assuming that Asian mix will get around 17% of this demand due to capacity reasons, the market share will be around 807 people. The concept of Asian mix is that it's a fusion of dishes from Japan, Korea, China, Thailand, and of course our beloved Philippines. For the direct competitors, we have Inengs, Teriyaki Boy, Mario Fiesta, and Kitaro, who offer similar cuisine as Asian Mixes Cuisine. For the indirect competitors, we have every restaurant in the Rosa Car Park. The big question is which of those Asian dishes are Asian Mix going to sell? Basically, what Asian Mix is going to sell is a fusion of various Asian rice meals and Asian noodles. Before we get to the main dishes, let's start with the appetizers first. For the appetizers, we'll be having isao, dynamite, shawmai, and squid balls. For the rice meals, we'll be having yang chow, bagoong rice, chahan, and kimchi fried rice. For the noodles, we'll be offering pad thai, chapche, yakisoba, and pancit kuglog. For the dessert, we'll be having sticky rice with mango, puto flan, mochi, and vanilla ice cream with red beans. For the drinks, of course, iced tea, coke products, and fruit juices. For the costing, all appetizers will be sold at 55 pesos per serving and will cost Asian rice mix at around 10 pesos per serving. The Yangsha or the most expensive dish that Asian Mix will be offering will cost 42 pesos and 88 cents, which will be sold at 150 pesos per serving. The Bagoong rice will cost 20 pesos and 22 cents. The Chahan will cost 31 pesos and 97 cents. The Kimchi fried rice will cost 28 pesos and 50 cents. All will be sold at the price of 120 pesos per serving. For the noodle dish, pad thai will cost at 33 pesos and 94 cents. The chop chai will cost at 24 pesos and 20 cents. The yakisoba will cost at 10 pesos and 67 cents. The pancit luglog will cost around 43 pesos and 53 cents. For the dessert, the sticky rice with mango will cost around 23 pesos and 48 cents. The puto flan will cost around 25 pesos. The mochi will cost around 30 pesos. The vanilla ice cream with red beans will cost around 15 pesos. All desserts will be sold at 90 pesos per serving. For the drinks, iced tea and fruit juices will cost around 2 pesos and will be sold at 30 pesos per cup. And of course, Coke products will be costing around 13 pesos and will be sold at 50 pesos per bottle. The initial investment for equipment, furniture, and fixtures will cost around 700,000. The monthly fixed cost will fall around 100,000. There will be 5 employees, 1 cook, 1 assistant cook, one waiter, one dishwasher, and one cashier. 
which is salary expense of around 60,500 monthly. Rent will be at 24,000, having a cost of 1,000 per square meter. Depreciation cost will fall around 6,000 monthly, and of course, the utility cost will probably cost around 10,000 monthly. This will give an income of 229,000 monthly, assuming that 30% of the computed market share will be going to Asian mix. This will mean an ROI in less than 4 months, making this concept feasible. People may ask, why will I choose Asian Mix among many direct and indirect competitors? The answer is simple. Asian Mix's menu is designed for people in a rush, particularly employees. Even the main dishes can be prepared, cooked, and served within 10 minutes. Plus, it is really easy to eat and it will definitely give the average Filipino a full stomach. Asian Mix's value proposition is satisfaction at a hefty price.